<laughs> Isn't that just wonderful? You know, I don't know what it is about opera music that gets me so, so in the mood to do my job. What do you think? Oh, you think it's creepy? Why am I not surprised? Oh, look at that. We're almost there. Unless you were lying to me and were just driving aimlessly for no reason. That wouldn't be good for you, by the way. I think it goes without saying that if you were lying to me, <laughs> I wouldn't react very well. You look confused. Let me elaborate. I have a saying. If you break your promise, I get to break something of yours. Therefore, if you were lying to me... <laughs> yes, exactly. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Looks like he's home. How unfortunate. Okay, give me your hands so I can unbind them. And then I'll get you your weapon. Okay. Remember what I taught you? Aim, shoot, blah blah blah. Looks like you got a clear shot from the back. Dummy's resting in a lawn chair. He won't know what hit him. <laughs> It's almost too easy. I would have rather gone for torture, but since you're such a... Since you want to get it over with quickly, this'll do. Go on. Take your best shot. You're thinking too hard. If you're worried about missing him, you're definitely going to miss him. Aim it, yeah. But also let your instincts take control. Yeah, that's right. And pull the true oh. Hey, hey, hey! <laughs> oh my gosh. You actually tried to shoot me! No, no! Calling out for help will not save you. Looks like your boyfriend's on alert now. I'll bet you everybody in a ten-mile radius heard that shot. Hey, breathe in. Enjoy your sleep while you can. And I mean really enjoy it. Welcome back to the bonus round, ladies and gentlemen. Once again, we have... The ungrateful hag that tried to kill her boyfriend. As you do. <sighs> do you recognize this room at all? Very good. Look at you, using your brain. Yeah, this is the room where we officially met. Right after I first kidnapped you. Did you ever wonder about that? Why I've kept you alive so long? Because I have. I've been racking my brain over and over and over again, trying to figure out why I keep you alive. And no matter how hard I try, I can't find an answer. So we're just gonna go with it. <laughs> You know, my mother wasn't entirely into my father when they first met. But after time and some tough love, she got the picture. And I believe the same will hold true for you. So, I'm gonna be patient. I'm gonna wait for you to love me back. And I'll look back on these moments when you try to shoot me or stab me when I'm not looking, and I'll say, wasn't that worth it? I told Sparrow 
about your little stunt today. She laughed her head off. She expected something like that from you. But who cares about what she thinks? I can see the diamond in the rough. And like all diamonds, in order to get your expensive, rich-looking diamond, you've got some rough work to do. Oh, and speaking of work, there's still a certain ex-boyfriend who's not dead. So I have to go clean up your mess before he reports too much to the police. <laughs> you want me to what? Do you really think I'm in any mood to listen to you? You want a what? Take his place. Well, isn't that noble of you? Do you think you can? Yeah? Alright then, what's your dominant hand? There we go. <laughs> okay. I guess he'll live. For now, anyway. Very brave of you. Stupid, but brave. Okay, then. Wow, saved me another trip. I'll see you later. Hello, hello, hello. I hope you enjoyed that audio. I'm going to give a quick shout-out to my Patreon members. Um, we have Lena, Hannah-Chan01, Nocturna Bunny, 875, C. Shoni, Hiono Fuko, Squire L, Lee Wolf, and Ariana. Thank you to you amazing patrons, and thank you to everybody else who watched the video. If you liked it, feel free to hit that like button, share, or leave a comment. And I hope you have a wonderful day or night.